Thank you for tuning in to another edition of the Vulcan Report. This report is an end-of-day report for trading on Thursday, June the 16th, 2016. This is our Bitcoin review, as you can see here. This is a chart of Bitcoin. Today was an extraordinary day in this market, primarily because it hit new 52-week highs. Another issue that is happening in this particular situation is that we have strong bids going into the close. It should also be noted that just as the stock market turned on a dime after being down all day, the Bitcoin rallied as well and hit new highs. Bitcoin rallied with the stocks, or you can even make an argument that it pushed the stocks. We also saw that just as the yuan, yuan was um, was having uh, outflows from it, you had rapid inflows into the Bitcoin. That should also be noted. Today was an extraordinary day for markets, primarily because we have basically a another satanic ritual sacrifice in that we had the gold and silver markets rallying to new highs, the new two-year highs in gold. Then, out of nowhere, the banksters smack it down and Bitcoin starts to rally from the outflows from the gold and silver and then inflows into the stock market in Bitcoin. All right, do you get those parallels there? Outflows from gold and silver inflows to the stock market and to Bitcoin. Why do you think that was happening? Is it a coincidence that also one of the uh, head people that is involved in the Brexit vote next week gets shot? Everything happened today on triple six, just as it was planned. Today is June the 16th, 2006, 666. And then you have a situation of massive pimperation in the markets. At one point, the Nikkei was down 600 points. Then it reverses on a dime. The, the Dow was uh, on its way to being down 200 points. And what happens? It finishes up 84 points on the day. Very interesting and questionable price action today. Also, the dollar remains to be propped up uh, by the Fed. The same time they come out yesterday and say, oh, we're going to leave rates alone. We can't do anything. As I've indicated before, they cannot raise the interest rates without destroying the economy and taking the market along with it. So what else happens? Well, crude oil gets crushed down almost two bucks today. And we have a situation where we're now right back to where we were in the gold and silver before the breakout. So it is looking like massive uh, manipulation underway. And I have more proof and evidence that Bitcoin is set up by the elite banking systems, the central banks. They're the ones that put this together and created this because this is going to be the new one world currency. It's going to be the cryptocurrency, the Bitcoin. And I will show you more evidences of that. Uh, in another video but for now this is what's happening this market continues to break out and it appears to be under the direct control of the none other than the Federal Reserve and the foreign central banks to get everyone ready then they talk about other things that's going on for, and this is supposed to be a cryptocurrency free from uh, federal oversight and the powers that be but it's acting like it's more controlled and manipulated than even the stock market and the gold and silver market and uh, the US dollar index. Very, very questionable uh, price action today in these markets. As you can see here, it's just straight up. Nothing goes straight up. Look how long it was flat. This is a weekly chart. Look at this. It was moving like this for months. Okay, then all of a sudden, boom just as that uh, Brexit vote is coming up too this is not a coincidence this is not a coincidence this market was doing nothing for a while look at this alright look at this look how long it stayed 
in its relatively price range. Look at this. Look at this. Okay. And then all of a sudden, we come here and now we explode. Very questionable uh, price action here in the Bitcoin with nothing to explain the why and the how. So just wanted to point that out to you. So um, keep your eyes open on this one. This is this is very, very, very telling. Remember, bulls make money, bears make money, and pigs get slaughtered. So remember to take what you can, give nothing back.